Hello everybody and welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the blue spinel trial badge. So to start off, just choose a character and go to the home world location. Okay, once you've done that, go ahead and choose a character that can fly. This is important. I'm going to choose her. Then go to blue diamonds room. Once you are there, head over this way. And we're going to go ahead and equip our wings. Scroll down the left side and then click fly. If you're on PC and keyboard, just go ahead and left click. I don't know what it is on mobile or tablet devices. Now, if you bump into an invisible wall, like how I am right now, just fly around. Keep pushing forward. Sometimes it just acts weird and doesn't let you go past. So just keep moving forward until there you go until it lets you up you're going to this little bit of i guess blue i call it the blue tic tac touch this card it will then teleport you to the blue spinel trial so once you are here the moment you cross this checkered line your time begins boom 360 seconds on the clock now these platforms right here are slippery so be careful Jumping is very helpful here. It helps control your person, your avatar from slip and sliding. Here, I do recommend waiting till you can jump onto a bigger part of this platform. I'm gonna wait a little bit longer. There we go. Boom, get a little closer and then jump on up. That part might be a little difficult. It might take you a couple tries to get on top of it. It's taking me a good bit to get used to all this i've had to restart many times your vision will go dark here but only temporarily until you get to the end now avoid those water drops they will not kill you immediately but they will hurt you they'll make you sit down kind of like a stun uh effect so here you're just going to run on this platform this narrow pathway it does not slide it's not slippery no worries ah there we go. So that's a good example of the water. Here's the hand. We're going to avoid it like so. And oh no. Anyways though, we're going to keep on going. Avoid the hand and the water. I like to think of these of my tears from all this pain I've been going through. Well, I'm going to wait for this hand. There we go. And we'll keep going forward. Oh gosh. I don't know what hit me there. What is hitting me? That is weird. It was not anything. Anyways, hug the right side here. Or the left it does not matter either way will work just avoid the big snowball and it just keeps resetting over and over I'm gonna wait for it to come back because I'm pretty weak right now so I do not want to risk any extra pain <laughs> which this trial is very pain it's so random that at some points I get close and then I get dead so Anyways, right here, we're going to go ahead and drop on down. A little shortcut you can do is simply jumping off the edge there and landing on the platform. Avoid the snowballs being launched from that cannon. You can just hug the side here if you want. Then here, I suggest just keep jumping because it will turn you into a ragdoll because it's a slide. So here we go. I'm going to wait for that. Mm, nope. Okay, there we go. Here, you're going to drop on down or jump down if you want. Get on the elevator hands. And here we go. This is where it can get a little crazy and dicey. Because it's so random that these balls come out of nowhere. And then the next part over here are the hands. These hands are terrible. You got to get on them, I suggest, as quickly as possible. But then you've got to... It's... Oh, God. It is so bad. This is terrible. I don't even know where I am. There we go. What I suggest you do is you get on one hand and then you just hop off of it when you are able to. Because it's just too crazy to just stay on the hand and then make your way across. So just keep doing what I'm doing. Just get on the hand and then hop on off. You can actually... There we go. Woohoo! You want to get on this elevator hand, it will take you up, boom, and there is the 
trial card. Go ahead and touch that and you'll get the badge. Now, once you touch it, it will bring you back here to the main game. Go to game badges and then scroll on down and you will get one badge morph. I'm going to go ahead and go to the world, home world center. And there we are. All that hard work for this. You get all these animations. You do get, though, some cool stuff. If you keep scrolling down, you get some items right here. You get an umbrella. You get a super jump. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything. Toonie run. That's super funny. It looks like actually a motorcycle. And then we got windmill hand. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> but then you can make it go faster. Now it looks like a saw. It's about to cut you up. Anyways, that's all for the day, folks. If you enjoyed, then go ahead and leave a like and subscribe down below to join the Bad Hunting Squad today. Use star code Digi whenever you buy Robux or Premium. And check out my Roblox group, my Twitter, and my Discord. Links in the description down below. As always, tell us and stay cool and go love badge hunting. Bye bye.